lot of people ask me about the proposition that the Book of Mormon took place in the state of Michigan, sometimes referred to as the theory of the Heartlanders. And uh, arguing about where the Book of Mormon took place is not always a, a worthwhile or profitable exercise. But what I like to do is point out some of the characteristics of the Book of Mormon that are unique and kind of have to be there. And so I point out three of them. And in my opinion, if these three characteristics aren't there, then you're not in the right place for the Book of Mormon. So you can take the three characteristics and then evaluate what these people claim. The first characteristic is, is the Book of Mormon says that throughout the land, there were towers and large and spacious buildings. And by towers, we mean tall enough to look over the canopy of the jungle and see armies preparing and coming to battle. So that's the first characteristic. The second characteristic is that we're told that the city of Moroni sank into the East Sea at the crucifixion. So wherever you think the Book of Mormon took place, whatever you consider the East Sea to be, you should be able to go there and find remnants of a sunken city that went down around 350 AD. The Book of Mormon also says that in 350 AD, the Nephites abandoned the land of Zarahemla and went into the land northward and uh, started another culture there and the Lamanites took, their, took over their ancient cities. So you have to find cities a place where cities were abandoned in 350 AD. A large population, uh, hundreds of thousands, if not millions of people. Those characteristics are common and unique and, uh, and are available in, Me in the Mesoamerica. We know that the, uh, the place around the Usumacinta Basin uh, was, had a huge population, that they had towers everywhere we call them pyramids. We know that at around, the archaeologists say around 50 AD, some of these cities sank into the sea off of the east coast of uh, what, we now, what we call Zarahemla. So these three characteristics exist in Mexico and southern Mexico and eastern Mexico. I don't know of any evidence that these characteristics appear in uh, upstate New York or in the area that the uh, Heartlanders claim to be the Book of Mormon. I don't know of any cities that are underwater. I don't know of any that were abandoned in 350 AD, etc., etc.